What's up everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Jake for those that are new here and hopefully today we'll get started mowing hay. Uh, this has been long overdue. We finally got some dry weather here and uh, we're working on the 1070 and hopefully going to get to that point to where we're comfortable enough with uh, mowing down some hay. We're just going to go right outside the, the shed in the place here and uh, hopefully we'll get quite a bit down. So I hope you enjoy the video. This is uh, hopefully going to be a couple days put together and uh, yeah, let's get started. Oh, so it should be too bad, I guess. Five three quarters. 
Okay, so I don't have a clip explaining what's going on. We got going on Saturday night and my brother took over after a few rounds of, of what I did and he went until it was just getting too dewy. And then the next day between services, I didn't have my cameras out there to be able to uh, get him to finish the one patch that we were working on the night before. He ended up working uh, a little bit more while we we're working on the 1070. Some of the drone footage that you're seeing is the next patch of him working on it. And he ended up having the bolt that drives the sickle uh, shearing off by the time I got the drone to him. So that's the reason why he's going nowhere at that point. So we ended up mowing down two more patches and getting five rounds around the big patch along the road, which I'll explain that a little later on. Now with the 1070 done, I'm gonna go feed a bale of hay real quick and then uh, get hooked onto the rake.
Well, I got all that uh, up north raked. Uh, we're gonna leave down south here and uh, let it dry for another day because it's still got some wet spots in it and it was pretty heavy. This up here, as you can tell probably in the video, it's pretty light. So now I'm gonna hook onto my baler and go try to bale some hay now. All right, we got all hooked on and ready to go, so I'm gonna head up north and start bailing.
So that's gonna shut us down for the night. Well, most likely you can't see me, but I'm gonna head over and get the 4010 and bring it into the shed. So then it's at least inside. And if we uh, don't get anything done with the tire here, well, we'll have hay on the ground, but not a super lot at this point, really. Maybe. I rolled up, uh, let's see here, one, two, three, four tonight before that tire started leaking. <laughs> We knew that we were on borrowed time with it because the split started showing up about last year. And the other tire had already went on us last year. So this year, buy another tire. Well, that'll do it for tonight. We're at a standstill with the tire. So we'll just play it by ear for the next couple of days hopefully we'll be able to get an answer on how quick uh, we can get a tire tomorrow uh, we won't be able to drive it to town it's getting bad enough they're just going from the north field up there a quarter mile south to the farm there so going to town won't be an option so we may have to do it ourselves or have a mobile guy do it so anyways uh, if you got to this point in the video Thank you, and if you're new here consider subscribing and We'll see y'all in the next one